Back YouTube, the beer year, day number 319, and I've got another one from the Harvestorm Brewing Company, and I've got the Shehelion, the Shehelion, it's actually a massive fucking mountain somewhere in the world that I don't know, and uh, it's crisp, refreshing, interpret, craft lager, 4.8% per alcohol, with a twist since 1983, so it's the same same deal, same mob as last week. It's 1.3 standard drinks as well. Like the famous mountain that takes its name from Shahilion, which is Shihaion, Shihaon, brings intense reward for the sort who like to plant their flag at the very top. Yeah. At the summit! The summit, motherfucker. The perfectly paired combination of wheat malt and lager malt with a secret source of Champagne lagers providing an elegant head, luxurious lacing, and a crisp palate. Geez, they put a bit of fucking spin on this bottle if I've ever heard one. A lingering, refreshing grapefruit finish from a whole pressed hop cones to top it off. Unstrap your knapsack and find a comfy bowler and pour yourself a premium pluck. Well, I reckon it's downhill from here. Best served at 8 degrees Celsius. Winner of the WBA World's Best Pilsner Award 2008. There we go. That's a fucking mouthful and I'm thirsty just reading all that. That must be a Pilsner, eh? It's a Pilsner. Mmm, smells like a Pilsner. So they've got a real nice um, multi bloody I'll just watch me golf is there. Yeah. It's got a nice malt malt flavour, slightly roasted coffee flavour there as well. And this a little hint of grapefruit that gives us a little bit of sweetness. It's a dry beer. It's not crisp, it's um it's fairly light on the mouth. There. It's all from a couple of sips. Let's pour it in. It's not like your standard, uh, if they class this as a Pilsner, it's not like your standard Pilsner. If it was supposed to win 2008 bloody Pilsner awards, and it's nothing like a Heineken or whatever Pilsners are out there. Nothing like that. Definitely, it tastes. More like a black beer, believe it or not. It's still pretty good. Got a one finger head. A little bit of no carbonation. Um, and it's, yeah, it's got a little bit of smoky flavour as well to it. Well, I'd, yeah, I'm going to have to give it a shit. I reckon if it had a bit more carbonation, it would get a three and a half. I'm going to give it a three. I mean, it's a nice, nice drink. Um, you know, not nice beer. I mean, it probably deserves more than a three, but um, it's just a bit, a little bit too bland. Um, but it just needs a bit, just a bit more sharpness to it. That's all. Yeah. Anyhow, that's enough of me raving on shit. I'm gonna sit back, enjoy this, watch the football, be kind to one and other people, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Happy Steve Take Irwin it easy. Day. Happy Steve Irwin Day too. Yeah. <laughs> Happy Steve Irwin Day. Crikey! By Jingos! Right? Steve Irwin Day. If you don't know who Steve Irwin is, look it up on Google. You'll be quietly amazed. Take it easy, people. Be kind to one another, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Crikey!